Donald Trump's narrow loss in Georgia in 2020 is still causing the state's Republican lawmakers to be stalled by infighting instead of focusing on 2024, according to a news report. The dispute is causing damage at a time when the Republican Party in Georgia should be incredibly united, according to the Wall Street Journal's piece. Georgia Republicans hold every major statewide office and a large majority in the state legislature. Governor Brian Kemp and Secretary of State Brad Raffensperger both won re-election last fall by triumphal margins, the article says. Under normal conditions, the state party might be celebrating and focusing on the 2024 presidential contest in the battleground state. However, the journal states, fights over Trump continue to dominate. Instead, Georgia Republicans are locked in a civil war stemming from former President Donald Trump's narrow 2020 loss in the state. The infighting comes during a state investigation, led by Fulton County Democratic District Attorney Fonnie Willis, into efforts to overturn that defeat, the journal reports. Those being investigated include Trump as well as David Schaefer, who recently left his post as GOP state chairman, and other state party officials. The infighting reportedly appears to have some effects long term. Today the bitter Republican divide threatens to weaken the state party apparatus, which once played a critical role in raising money and coordinating volunteers during the GOP's rise to power, the article states. It might end up making the party structure irrelevant. When the party held its state convention earlier this month, Kemp, Raffensperger, Attorney General Chris Carr and Insurance and Safety Fire Commissioner John King were all no-shows.